Hi guys, uh, today I'm going to show you just a few things that I normally worry about on the control panel and you may need to use, but I use these very regularly and you will if you do the same things that I do on my, com on my computer. Uh, I'm using it on my laptop and I mainly play games on my laptop uh, and I'll be showing you how to, ch how to update the drivers on, because I've got an Nvidia, but the RAID on the, the, the radon still work and you can still do it the same way because it should still have a the same application sign up. Uh, so if I go into uh, control panel for you now up here where it's got uh, on the top bar uh, it's got classic view and control panel home. Now uh, Vista has changed it to control panel home. I hate it this way. Uh, I'm used to XP I'm used to Windows 2098-95 so I've got a classic view uh, and this is just a quicker way of finding anything I need um, <clears throat> the main ones that I mess with is uh, internet options and you can change your, your home page, all your security settings, privacy, content, connections, programs, advanced. Um, I wouldn't mess with anything past those three to be honest. Uh, you can delete all your stuff if you want to if you don't want someone to find out where you've been going on or you're opening a, uh, an application up that checks your, your cookies and all that kind of stuff. Uh, your security systems, you can check how I've got medium slash high because I, I have a um, I have AV, AVG and it seems to protect me from everything. Uh, program updates, that's one of my main ones. It opens Update Manager. Uh, now this is a very good one for updating your drivers in case you buy a new game and it doesn't work on your system uh, and you think to yourself, well maybe it might be my um, drivers for my uh, graphics card. Now it should open up this update manager and it should go check for updates now and it will check um, all the hidden ones and the ones that maybe you not need to install but it will still show them all up. And you can do a settings um, check which is like all the new uh, Vista updates for the internal kind of schematics of the computer. Uh, but you don't really, the update settings, um, I haven't really messed with that but yeah, that's how you do that then. And you just click. You can do a scan and everything like that. Um, one mainly one, my Nvidia Control Center or Control Panel. Sorry, uh, it should open this up. I've got mine set to performance, and it still looks okay. But oh well. And you you can do all of your different um, settings from here. You can always go to I think it's Advanced Settings here, and you can show you can show Standard, and it only shows a few, and then it shows Advanced, and it shows some more. Um, some more settings that you can change it on. You can go to manage 3D settings and change all that stuff. With Ray, I, I don't know. Um, I don't know roughly what it is. Uh, another one that I use is performance information. Uh, it does pretty much. It, 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 it's another quick shortcut to another video I've done about how to make your computer faster and stuff like that. Uh, you can find out all your um, settings and your ratings of the computer you can go to advanced tools and sort out your memory usage and stuff like that uh, another one I use mainly is, is personalized but I don't do it through the control panel I do it via the right click on the desktop which is like quicker for me um, another one um, that I go on to if I just find it it is system that's it down the bottom uh, this is the same thing, but I can go into advanced system settings, find out the the real information to see how much RAM I'm using, up, how much space I'm using, up, what my memory usage is, and stuff like that. And it, it pretty much you can go you can go to this screen via different routes, but I mainly keep it at that. I apologise for my rating; it's because of my uh, my graphics card. It's not the best. Uh, so those are that's the basic um, that's the basic control panel. Uh, applications I use and if you're doing pretty much the same thing as me then you're going to use the same things as me if you use it for gaming you definitely want to keep control of that uh, Nvidia because each game requires different settings for it so you definitely need to know exactly how to get there fast 
otherwise you'll start to think well maybe I've broke my PC or something but you haven't you just mainly need to change the drivers or update them uh, you can always go onto the websites and go onto NVIDIA and it will do an automatic scan for you to check if you need new updates uh, the, my, uh, with mine my, my laptop's HP now I get a HP update every two days uh, and every other time it updates I normally get Vista uh, transformation packs and stuff like that the only thing you need to be careful on the updates about Vista is some of them you really don't need and I, I've heard of a lot of problems that some of the um, update packages uh, won't let you use third party uh, systems i.e. you stick a, uh, a DVD in your disk drive it won't read it because it's a third party system um, so you just need to be careful what updates you use and what updates you install you can always hide them so that you don't have to use them but they'll still be there just in case you want to install them you don't have to delete them or anything you just hide them um, so do it that way but that's the main main uh, solutions I can give you towards updating for Vista so thank you very much any comments will be uh, happily replied to uh, if you've got any queries or anything like that just, just comment me and please subscribe and cheers thanks